And I will give the floor to Henna Virkonen for the Committee on Industry, Research and Energy. Please. Madam President, Commissioner, dear colleagues, on behalf of the ITRA Committee, I would like to thank all the rapporteurs and shadow rapporteurs for your good, good cooperation on this very important file. Europe must strengthen our economic and security capabilities across all critical sectors. One of these critical areas is the pharmaceutical industry. It's one of our most important industrial sectors. It employs directly more than 840,000 people in Europe and invests over 40 billion euros annually in research and development. These figures are significant, but the pace of growth and investments in comparison to re regions such as Asia and the United States are significantly higher. It means that incentives for pharmaceutical development, research and new innovations in Europe must be increased. Otherwise, there is a risk of new investments increasingly flowing to other parts of the world. It's important to ensure the availability of critical medicines in all situations in Europe, and therefore, ITRI Committee sees that in this legislation is particularly important to focus on our competitiveness, security of supply, and the promotion of research, development, and new innovations on this sector.